This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Friday, November 10th. Carnival Cruise Line has been forced to cancel four upcoming sailings of Carnival Panorama as it heads to dry dock this weekend. This is over the ship's ongoing propulsion issues. Those canceled sailings are November 11th, also the Thanksgiving sailing of November 18th, November 26th, and December 2nd. The technical problems, which led to the cancellation of two out of the three ports during its current cruise, is scheduled to be addressed in this dry dock. Now, impacted passengers are receiving a full refund, reimbursement for expenses, and a 50 to 100 percent future cruise credit, depending on their booking date. Carnival Panorama, which has a history of propulsion problems similar to those of Carnival Horizon and Carnival Vista, is expected to resume service after dry dock on December 9th. And Viking Cruises has filed a lawsuit against Arch Insurance Group in the Circuit Court of Jackson County, Missouri, accusing them of failing to reimburse travel protection premiums refunded to guests during the pandemic. Now, despite Viking's immediate compensation to the guests, they allege that Arch has not fulfilled its financial obligations of the reimbursement for over three years now. This is resulting in Viking having to cover more than $3 million in refunds. The case will go to court on April 4th if no agreement is reached. And closing its 2023 cruise season, the Port of Seattle celebrated a record-setting year with 291 cruises and 1.77 million passengers. The season's economic boon neared 900 million thanks to each cruise ship's 4 million local contribution. Seattle is anticipating 277 cruise calls next year, and the port is set to continue its streak of high passenger volumes into 2025 and 26 as well. Way to go. And a reminder that Royal Caribbean's gratuities increase tomorrow. Standard cabins go from 16 to 18 and suites from 18.50 to 20.50 per person per day. And the photo of the week comes from Daryl Bird of Carnival Celebration here in Costa Maya, Mexico. I think I was on this cruise. Send yours to Doug at CruiseRadio.net. Remember, all photos are subject to air. And cruise line stocks were down on Thursday. Carnival Corporation down 3.7%, 12.31. Royal Caribbean down 3%, 92.60. And Norwegian down 5%, 12.76. If you have a lead on a story, you can send it my way. Tips at cruiseradio.net. And this weekend, let's remember to honor our veterans, their service, and their sacrifice. Keep the spirit of freedom alive. Thank you for everything. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Have yourself a great weekend.